I was in a really, really difficult time in my life, living in my car, running from a lot of things, and I got to a point where I had just given up. I've had several pretty severe traumas in my life that I feel like a part of me died in that moment. You try to keep going, but it's really hard to stay positive and to keep believing that something's gonna change. My car was breaking down. I didn't know how much longer I'd have anywhere to go. I wrote letters to my family, and I had a plan lined up. Two days before I was, I was planning to end things, I found Bella. She was under a shed at the safe parking lot. They were tearing the shed down and catch these kittens because they won't survive. I caught her and the very first night she slept, just curled up here and she saved my life. It felt like a God moment. I had no idea where I would go. A lot of shelters said, no, we don't take cats. A woman said, try Rachel's. It's a place where there's great resources and where there's also a community of really amazing women in need of a little help. There's a woman there named Kelly. Ask for her. I called. Kelly answered the phone. I tell her my story a little bit. My car's about to break down, but I have this kitten, and I know it's gonna sound ridiculous, but I have this kitten that I can't, I can't live without her. Kelly just said, oh yeah, okay, so that's your emotional support kitten. Not a problem. Um, yep, just come on tomorrow. I feel safe here to have people that see through all the brokenness into somebody that is worth trying to save and to give a chance to. There's just not even words for that. Today, I'm moving into my own place. I'm really, really excited. All of the staff here never gave up on me, on us, and are the reason that I'm finally, finally, gonna have my own place and this feels truly like my second chance to have the life that I desperately want and that I desperately want to give Bella.